So, hey guys, Chelsea here. So I got my Rainbow Roger Odin now, so I thought I'd kill some arena with Final Tap, but just that wouldn't be fun. Let's add something more to it. Let's add doing the Super Tandem with the new free-to-play TKA Whitebeard first to get an additional buff. And to make it even more interesting, we're going to be killing with Roger Odin's Rush through Attack Down. And my intention actually was for just this first arena to be to attack down, but it ended up being both arena. Uh, the second team was actually uh, a real wreck, I must say, but I kept it in for the hilarity of it. Sometimes I feel like everything I put out has to be absolutely sparkling, clean and perfect, but uh, that team just went so bad, but it still worked out. So. That can also be interesting in its own way. But yeah, as you see, we're back with Arena Kawamatsu. Uh, it's one of the arenas I do the least because it's so easy. But it's also one of the few strength arenas. I decided to revisit it. But now I'm going to take a break from this for a while, I think. There's only so much you can bullet. But yeah, we're going to do like I did with the Sengoku and Yamato showcase I did. and. Just stall here for a bit. So if you saw that video, you, your question might be how do I plan to get around the barrier this time? And actually the Whitebeard special does remove one turn of barrier, so perfect. That makes it a lot easier. Don't have to run some weird ship or anything. See if it works out. Otherwise, like usual, I try to satisfy all the EX conditions, it's not always easy, but... But yeah, we've done enough stalling. We will have all of the super swaps ready for final stage. You see that Yamato is lagging behind a bit, but after Kinemon special next stage, it's going to be ready. So yeah, we do resist the bind thanks to Yamato Captain. Kinemon to get a nice score boost, remove the damage reduction. I also use the EX because why not? Get some guaranteed matching orbs. I also don't want to randomly get a one orb with Whitebeard because that's a real possibility. Some foreshadowing here for the next team as well but honestly that's one of the biggest weaknesses of Roger Odin the fact that you will get one orbs when you don't want to and it just messes up your plans pretty bad when that happens so yeah final stage here I'm going to make use of Yamato's EX again to reduce the uh, CD for the team. Uh, Sorrow Super Swap will give us the matching orbs and especially the tandem orb we want for Whitebeard. Then we use the Roger Odin special for attack boost and war boost. And then we can buff those with Sorrow Sanji. Get the shame buffs we need. Let's see if I remember to use Sora Sanji's EX. Maybe I forgot. Not that it matters, but... Yamato special there. Call Affinity, increased damage taken. And yeah, you see I almost kill with the attack down there, but we get to do some nice rush overkill through uh, attack down. So yeah, that's enough Kawamatsu bullying for quite some time. Shame I forgot about Sora Sanji EX though. Anyway, moving on to uh, Crocodile. And as I already said, this run went very bad. Uh, one thing that went extremely bad is that for some reason I thought Chopper would remove all of the buffs final stage, which he did not. So that was quite a miscalculation. Uh, but that's far from the only thing that went wrong. 
But yeah, like, can you blame me like when I can do a super tandem in two hits? I want to do a super tandem in two hits. I don't care if that has the risk of messing up my ore plans for this run. But yeah, uh, we're stalling for the Scabbers legend, by the way. I wanted to use the Skiak legend, but then I wouldn't have the EX for all units. Uh, I don't really think that full New Year batch team is going to be super viable going forward. But they've been used, fun to use for content. And I do like the full batch more than I usually do. It's very, very strong and well designed and it also isn't brain dead like all of them have very different conditions to keep in mind and such that keeps it interesting yeah, another thing i did was that i didn't didn't add any support to remove the death up but at least that worked out we did so if he do so much damage it doesn't matter another dumb thing i do i swap sora sanji before the scabbard that's very unfortunate. But yeah, filling up the chain here, trying to break through. And yeah, we're able to do it, it's all good, let's continue the run. But it's now it goes very bad, as you see, it happened. Wipey got a one orb, but not only that, this stage locks towards for three turns. So I had to change my plans here, thankfully at least that worked out pretty well. But the problem is of course now I can't use the Super Tandem, and the idea of the video was to use the Super Tandem. So the strat I decided to do is stall one extra turn, this way I remove the orb lock, I can tap with Viper, remove the one orb, and pray I don't get another one orb, because yeah that's what you have to do when using Roger Odin sometimes. Roger Odin is just not designed to play around with one orbs. Which is why it's pretty funny they made this white beard for Roger Odin. But yeah, one more turn of stall there. And now I can remove it and hoping it doesn't come back. But as I've already said, uh, final stage turned out to be quite a disaster. But yeah, we used the EX supers here, and yeah, a cool mechanic here when we use Yamato. Uh, Crocodile tries to remove the buff, but we have the Roger Odin privilege here, so we get to keep it. Yeah, it's some more paralysis, which is fine, Chopper removes it, and the binders is assisted by Yamato, so all is good, great synergy for the team. Roger Odin special for some extra attack and ore boost. Then they use Shocker and that's when it goes wrong because I want to remove all of the special bind. I want to remove the attack down. It didn't remove all of it, that's just my bad. I forgot about how Shopper works. But I decided, let's finish this, let's see how much damage they do. I didn't think I would be able to kill. I don't have that many buffs. But what will you know? They actually managed to break through pretty easily, so that's the video. See ya. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.